this one that identify and I'm looking for it as I look for it inwardly it disappears so if there's enough intensity in the looking I remain the looker that is looking only at itself nothing else to look at mm. so, you, so you need to be guided through that Maybe in the beginning externally, yes, yes. actually it happens all internally. Mm -hmm. By question, mm. explore, checking what, what would, is the experience. What would encourage someone to do that? If the, and when they already have a name and form. Knowledge. Meeting a living being Me meeting a living that being. actually is living it and mm. awaken mm. and see that what the knowledge does because he did for what he thought his mind the same thing, right? He met mm. another living being who shared the knowledge or was awake and that living being shared some wisdom, knowledge and that turns his attention inward and had the clarity how to discern and inquire and awaken to who one truly is. So there has to rise a question, no? Yes. Except it's not any question. Not any. It's yeah. not going to be a why. It's not going to be a why. Why is it happening to me? Yeah. Why, why no, is this not. thought appearing? Yeah. Yeah. What? Yeah. Not the why. It, it's going to be it is happening to me. Is it true? Yeah. It's one has to realize and through exploring and investigation that nothing is happening to me. Mm. Happening is everything is happening for me to see that it's not me. Mm. Mm. This is discriminating. Is it mm. true? Yeah. So, nothing is happening to me because I am changeless awareness, boundless, yeah? Mm. So it has no thought whatsoever. So, I am thoughtless. And then there is the notion that I am the one who is thinking and these thoughts are mine. Mm. And whatever thoughts I have, if I like them, I want more of this. And if I don't like the, these thoughts, I resist these thoughts. So then I, I feel these thoughts, it's ha I'm thinking it, it's my thoughts, so it's happening to me. Mm. So I'm affected. There is a relationship between the I thought and my thoughts. So I can affect my thoughts and my thoughts can affect me, I. Mm. Yeah? Which is all an illusion. Mm. I'm neither this thought I, neither the thought my, I am behind it. Yeah silently aware, no relationship with that. So when I realize that everything that is happening is for me to see that it's not me, this is how the mind awakens from the dream that is locked into, caught into. If I'm dreaming at night and I go through different experiences in the dream and I'm and I experience all that is happening in the dream is happening to me. Suddenly I wake up in the morning and I realize that what I was dreaming is not real. Nothing really happened mm -hmm. and it really didn't happen to me. Mm -hmm. So there was a beginning of awakening. I was awakened from the dream. Still is in the mind. Mm. Yet it's a very important process that the mind starts to wake up from the dream it, it is created. I'm not I accept, not accept, I never accept, accept when you do wake up. You know that what happened in the dream is not you, but you know that you dreamed. The you dream. It, this is the false notion That's because the false notion. there is the notion that I am a separate entity. So I was the, the, the actor 
and then there were other uh, actors and I was in relationship between the main actor as I and other, another imaginary image that I was in relation with them, mm -hmm. either affecting them or they are affecting me. Either I like them or I dislike them. I move like this in the dream. Yet this I and this imaginary images, other conceptual image that are stored in the memory, have nothing to do with who I am. I have no relationship, so anything that is happening in the dream is not happening to who I truly am, to me. Not a thought, the field of awareness. Mm -hmm. So it's happening for me as the mind now to wake up and realize that it's not me, that I am not the mind. Same. The mind can only know that it is not the mind itself. Mm. It can know that it, it can... <laughs> I can know what I'm not. I cannot know who I am. When I experience directly who I am, there is a knowing that I am that, not of the mind. This is your experience yeah. too. Uh, uh, when you I'm, experience I'm just trying, it. What I'm, ex what I'm attempting to do is see the a make a relationship with the words. Yes, see where that's they, they yeah, make that's, your experience That's exa exactly right. Yes. So there's a parallel mm -hmm. of dream waking up and mind thoughts waking up. Yeah, because right now, unless you experience who you are, what is the proof that we have that this is not really a dream? Like in the dreaming state. How do we know that this state that we are at is not actually a longer dream with the senses open? We don't. Then. Without the knowledge of who you are, there is that. it's just another dream. So who awakens yeah. from the dream? Not awareness. Awareness never fell asleep. Mm. It's the mind wakes up from the dream mm. that it created mm. out of confusion, mm. out of ignorance, looking for the source. Mm. So, and denies, that's the process of awakening. And denies that it is, that it is me. And, and it denies that it was me. Because everything is within the source. Yes, within who you are. Within <laughs> who you are. Yeah. But wakes up already, denying who it is. That's right. Ignoring mm. the, what it is looking mm. the most. Mm -hmm. All living beings mm. desire to be happy, mm. always without any misery. And, and, and in case they can't name it, it doesn't know it. <laughs> so <laughs> what the mind, because it's yeah. made from name and form, form yeah. all it can know is name and form. Oh. It cannot know something that has no name and no form. Mm. So that's point. When you experience who you are and there is mm. a knowing, recognize no. that it's not of the mind. So when the question comes, it's the only way to recognize that you are not that. The question, who am I? The, that's the only way the mind will be able to be dissolved. There is no other way. It's the way for the mind to discern this, and the discerners reveal as soon as it puts, gets quite as soon as it questions its existence and as form, there's there's an opening. Right. Because the moment the mind questions its existence, because the mind is non existent existence remain itself. Mm. Mm. Such, a, such a, a beautiful, it's beautiful. The words are beautiful. We can stop this.